comic get your gains hey welcome back all you gainers out there to another exciting episode of Comic Games. Oh. And if you're new to the show, I'm Adam. I'm Zach. And this is the Gwen Stefani Princess. Oh. She ain't no holla back girl. Back, oh. bow down. Bow down, bow down. So, uh, today is Wednesday. What are we doing on Wednesday, Zach? <gasps> what's, what's in, in the, the box? box? So, we're going to be kicking up some what's in the box. And we have some YouTube it's buys and some also to... some street level hero buys. Oh, we're going to see you. what we got today. Are you singing? No, I wasn't. A little nope. bit of singing? A little bit of action? A little bit of alcohol? Oh, yeah, what are we drinking? For sure. What are we drinking? Well, it's we got day. IP Industrial by Domino. Local brewery to us. Washington. Love it. Anacortis, right? Isn't Diamond Knot Anacortis? Well, there you can go to Diamond Knot in what, well, no, what, no, Muckleteo. Oh, okay. But they might be in that. Well, no, what, yeah, they could be in Anacortis, actually. Yeah. Huh. Mm. Anyways, regardless. I'll look that up. What later. is it? Regardless, what does it taste like? Now, what does it taste like? Okay, let's go. What does it taste like, Scott Tinneman? Ooh, it's nice. I think now, they made it in a factory. It kind of smells like space dust. Space dust by Elysian? But let's see. It does it taste better. Space dust, coast to coast. I think they're about equal. This one's a little bit more bitter. But I mm, like it too. Bitter, bitter. Also, guys, stay tuned to the end of the episode because we're going to announce the winner of the Three Joker War, book number one. What? Number yeah. one. So, uh, if you guys are new to What's in the Box, we <clears throat> look through Zach's uh, graded boxes. Uh, most of the time, they are unorganized, but he's learning. So, we found a box. We finally dug deep. We found a box that has Michael yeah, Turner only in it. Mostly only Michael Turner, a little bit of Aspen. But... This has been a really cool box so far. So we've been checking them out. The princess randomly pulls a graded book out of the box, and then we kind of talk about it, and Zach lets us know little details, a little action. Maybe if he took it from a small child. Or a homeless man. Yeah, that'd be bad, though. That would be bad. That would be bad. Well, he probably doesn't need it. I don't know. The same. All right. Ready, guys? (gasps) What's in the box? And if you guys don't know Michael Turner, you will know Michael Turner after this. Amazing artist. Yeah, definitely. Okay. If you've watched these consecutive videos, you better know who Michael Turner is now. So violent. Take it easy there, <laughs> Gwen Stefani. <laughs> what we got here? Ooh. All right, so we got oh, that's a good one. Michael Turner Soulfire Zero. This is from 2004. Uh, it's a Wizard World 2004 con edition from it's, Philadelphia. And if it's limited, usually it says, oh, right here. Limited to 2500 Wow, that's it's hard cool. to see on that one. 9.8. So, uh, you buy that on eBay as well, Zach? Yeah, Get those for sure. eBay games. I got those eBay games. Also, it was in a lot. That was in a lot. I always buy these in a lot. Usually, the people that sell my turn covers sell it like run, run, run. Is that a virgin variant too? No, it's not. No, that's right. Sometimes, it says Soulfire on the front. Sometimes there's a couple of virgin variants, and those things are... Sick. That must be like early Aspen stuff, if it's 04, right? Yeah. Yeah. Fairly early. Yeah. I think they came out in 1999. Oh, really? I think so. I, I might be wrong. Now. I'm, I might be wrong. All right. Without further ado... <gasps> what's, what's in, in the, the box? box? What's in the box? Mm. These must be aftermarket uh, sleeves, so you can buy. They're like mylar sleeves. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, be careful with those. Don't be careful with them. Teach them a lesson. So mean. Oh, this is cool. Whoa. Michael Turner, Fathom, Kiani. Kiani. Kiani, yeah. number two. What? Well, no, it's this not. This one's yours. going to the princess, I think. No. No. So this is also a Philadelphia, uh, but 2007 exclusive from Wizard World East Con Edition. This is cool. 9.8. I like the cover on that. I don't know if that's... She's almost kind of like a little like water goddess kind of yeah. looking thing. Did that come in the same lot as the last one? It might have been. Uh, I bought many, many lots. It's like somebody from Philadelphia um, was selling these. Sometimes I and saw... knew that Zach wanted them. Sometimes I get for like a really good deal. Others, <clears throat> like the Michael Turner, ske- uh, Michael Turner signatures, they're really, really hard to get for a good price. Yeah. Those are like, cool though. Insane. So, signatures are crazy. Yeah. Yeah, it's... It's amazing. Yeah. So, next one. What's, What's in the box? And I've lost so many bits because it just went over to like 200. Oh. Just on a signature? 
Yeah. yeah. Just because it's a signature. You got to hang on to those Michael Turner signatures. At least the signatures, yeah. Yeah. Uh, I really love Michael Turner, so I'll probably hang on to them for a while. They're very hard to find. Okay. Oh, I like this one's cool. So we got another Iron and the Maiden. Uh, this is gold label, guys. Old gold label, Number too. Zero. This is where it doesn't have the, the gripper thing on the back. No, no. For the hand, yeah. the hand gripper thing. But number zero, signed by who? Uh, Francis Man Mumpo. Okay, so this isn't signed by uh, Michael Turner? No, this is probably also a lot. Probably had a Michael Turner book in it that was signed by Michael Turner. But it's Aspen, one. though. It's Aspen. Yeah. I think there's two covers, at least. Iron and the Maiden. That's a really cool name for a book. Mm, it is. I've never read it, though. I need to. Just it's... crack that open. Yeah, no. Read it. But this is They all... would understand. I mean, yeah, this is a Michael Turner, but it's a book that he wrote, I believe. But it's from, his, com it's from his company, too. It's Aspen from his company. company. At least from I his company. I can see your logic and how you put it in the box there. I wonder if he did write it. That'd mm. be kind of cool. Anyways, I think last one... Yeah. Last one... What's, What's in the, the box? box? That's a cool beanie, princess. Yeah, where'd you get that beanie? Is that from... Jose Gonzalez? Spidey Powder Tumblers? <gasps> what? Yeah. So if you guys want to get a beanie like that, check them out. Yeah, how do I find that? With the, do, with the link the down link? below? Oh, the link down below. Oh. Yeah. Oh, so yeah, she actually looks really good in that beanie. The beanie's it's pretty really sick. Good. Yeah. I won't lie. I'll have to get Zach a pink one. Oh my God, finally... Finally! Oh, these are cool. Yes. This was done... That one's going to the princess, right? No. <laughs> this was done after her death. So this book is impossible to get a Michael Turner signature on it. But it's, to me, one of the best Michael Turner covers of Supergirl ever. It's amazing. So you got, uh, yeah, Supergirl number 50. Uh, backup story by Jake Black, Helen Slater, Cliff Chiang. And it's signed by Jamal Egel and Cliff Chiang. Cool. But it's cover art by Michael Turner. It's cover art. Yeah. They're... He draws Supergirl so good. It was two years after his death, so it's kind of like... Is that from the sketchbook then? Yeah, from the sketchbook. But that sketch is one of the best sketches I have ever seen. That's Done cool. by Michael Turner. It's really great. It's... I don't know. I don't think he did another... They did another Michael Turner uh, cover up until... Uh, from his death to this. So I could be wrong, but... For Supergirl, you I'm, Yeah, for, for anything. I, don't, I, I think there was like a stretch of two years where they didn't do anything. I could be wrong, though. Very cool. It's a, oh, it's one of my favorite covers. That one's really cool. What do you think it's worth? I have no idea. Priceless? Is it priceless? It's priceless to me. It's at least probably worth 100 bucks. I would pay 100 bucks for that. Yeah. Cool. More. So uh, that's what's in the box so far this week. We still have at least two more, two more Wednesdays for you in there, yep. I would say. So stay tuned for some more Michael Turner goodness. So on to the next thing. We've got a package from Mr. Let that we got on Chad RCG's auction. Amazing auction. Love the auction. So we've gotten a couple, a couple things from Mr. Let before. They've all been great. The, the quality of the books have been amazing. Um, and a lot of times you can get them for like a good price. So if you ever see him in Chad's auction or Thoro's auction, check him out. Really, really good stuff. Really, really good. And you can really tell that he's a great guy. Charismatic. Punctual. How is he punctual? I, I don't know. I just like saying that. Anyways, he's a good guy. He has great comics. Uh, he really cares about people. I mean, if you have a problem with his order, he's just like, all right, refund the money. He's a good guy. He, you can't go wrong from buying from him. And usually he's on Chad RCG's channel. He's on a channel a auction, a live auction. He's on, I think, Thoro's auction. And one other one, I think. It's a good thing I didn't just already say that. <laughs> oh, did you already say that? Hold on. <laughs> Is he also on uh, the New York Warriors? No. No? All right. Wait, Zach's been drinking. Sorry. I've been drinking. Zach's been so. drinking. What time is it? Is it 8 a.m.? 8 in the morning? 5 o'clock somewhere. <laughs> hey. If you guys... I don't actually remember what um, what the princess bought from him, but I think it was something good. I think I was there, and I said, buy it. All right. Buy it. You got the first one. Let's see what we got here. Let's see what we got. Oh, so we got... Yeah. Yes. Oh, yeah. This is cool. So you got the Ultimates number two. First appearance of... 
who? The Lightbringer. Is it? Which okay. is Galactus, but... He's golden this Galactus. Gold. Yeah. I think that's the <clears throat> second print variant, but that's the most desirable one. That's I like think. the Da Vinci, right? Yes. Isn't that Leonardo Da Vinci? Leonardo Da Vinci. He didn't actually do that cover, but that would be cool. Yeah, that'd be cool. He comes back, does the cover, and then dies again. He never died. He never died. <laughs> Alright, next book. Okay, this is the first Thor wait. First cover of Thor versus the God Butcher. I is think it? I think that's what it There's was. There's something important with that book. I think that's what it is. It's like, re it's relative to, I think, Silver Surfer number four. You know, Thor versus uh, Silver Surfer. Whereas Thor versus the God Butcher. Gore the God Butcher. Gore the God Butcher. That's I think a cool that's, name, dude. I think it's like a $20 book, but we're probably going to get that grade, hopefully. Yeah, yeah, we'll, we'll have to research it. Yeah. That's cool, though. Yeah, first we don't have first Gore the God Butcher. That's a really cool cover, too. I like that one. Very cool character. I think he should be ended up in the MCU pretty soon. Yeah, yeah, so I, yeah I believe so. Go along with our current books behind us. We got Shuri number two. This is the first time she dons the costume, right? I thought the Black Panther two she. Dons. That's her first appearance. There's. That's probably right, guys. Yeah, I think right. I think Shuri two is the first time she puts on the costume. That one's really cool. I actually really like that cover. It's like yeah. holding the helmet. Costume looks all good on her. Contemplating. It's skin tight, guys. So it's nice. You can see it's everything. Nice. Oh, I can dig that. I can mm. dig that. So really, really good pickup. Uh, oh, Princess got from Mr. Let. I'm really thinking about it. But yeah. yeah. Sorry, Princess. Thank you, Mr. Let. Awesome books as usual. Really, really cool. So You're very charismatic. No, <laughs> so we got a couple. Um, we got a couple of uh, books. That we got from Street Level Hero. One that Zach ordered and one that I ordered. So we'll see what we got here. If you guys aren't familiar with Street Level Hero, they're connected with that Spider-Man booth loosely. Loosely connected. Um, they do both have apps now. So you can download Street Level Hero's app. So you get notifications when like uh, new books are being released and stuff like that. I actually really like ordering stuff from them too. That um, Really, really cool company to order from. And you can download that Spider-Man booth app now. Which you can buy the... Uh, $30 2.0 mystery boxes on there. Probably even buy the superior boxes when they come out. I'm wondering if you can even get Monday Mania on there now, too. I the think check there, out I think there was a... T actually, I looked at the la app, app recently, and it has a Monday Mania app. So Yeah. So, download the app. I don't know. When we download it, we got a $15 off coupon. I don't know if that's still going on um, or what how that's surrounded, but download the app, man. Get you guys... Get those games. That's how you get them. Mm -hmm. So... We got a run Los Angeles box. We gotta like build a house out of all these boxes that yeah, we have like to burn just, them. you know, burn the house, get the insurance money, right? So let's see. This is some Zach bot. So let's see if he made any wise decisions here. Oh, I know what it is. Cause he just looked at it. It was covered in bubble wrap. How would I know what it is? This is something you got for the princess, right? No. Oh, we gave you a thank you book. What? Yeah. Okay, so we got... That was uh, surprising. This is the Mercadio. Are you, is that the right... Who did the artwork on that? Maybe G. Antoleto or... Is it? Mm. We'll see. Oh, he knows me so well. I know, that's funny. I just, I just took a quick... Yeah, uh, Miguel Mercadio. Miguel Mercadio. So this Cardio. is one... I bought one of these for the princess and Zach liked it so much he bought one. Um, cool story that, like, that came out of Unknown Comics and was sold out, like, immediately. And then you just check out... Uh, street level hero and I was able we were able to pick it up so and they have street level hero as the bonus where if you spend a hundred dollars you get a free shirt so and all their shirts are dope What's they're, shirt, though? they're really really good shirts on there yeah very high quality yeah we're waiting on two they now. don't shrink when you wash them most of the time so this is interesting and they're um, limited they actually gave Zach a free book with it so it has like the thank you you're welcome and guess what book it is it's a Michael Turner cover book. So I love Michael. Someone Turner. must be watching our show yep. on the Michael Turner episode. So I didn't even know that was in there. Yeah, right. I didn't know either. Yeah. Uh, thank you, JP. So that's Witchblade awesome. number fifteen. Got he's got like a tiger face dude and then a tiger. Yeah. You start like living with your tiger too long, you start to look like him. Yeah. Become a liger. Wait, that's, that's different. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Person tiger. Oh. <laughs> a person and a tiger. All right. 
So we got one more. This is one I bought from them. I'm not remembering what was in this at all. Oh, so warm. Okay. Like I said, download their app. Whoa. You can get some crazy deals. We got a new box here? This is a new box. Oh, this is one I haven't seen before. So we got a see you soon box. If you guys don't know, that's uh, JP's sign off. See you soon. At Thank the end. you. Thank you. You're and welcome. See, yeah, thank you. You're welcome. And see you soon. And see you soon. Because you always see him again. I, every I, every day at 5 p.m. I really like JP. JP is a very, very nice guy. And the customer service of his company, which I think he actually handles the customer service, is very, very on point. If you have a problem, you message, you message him. He messes you back like within a day. This one's creepy. Wow. Yeah. So we got the... Uh, Actually, and I thought something might be out. something so. might be special with this book. I'm not sure. I may have been wrong, but Thor Seven. It's the Mercadio Virgin, and uh, it's got Noel on the cover. So if you guys don't know, Noel's really, really hot. Really, really hot. Noel is not a bad spec. Yeah, not bad at all. I don't know. It's cool. Thor is like a really hot run right now. I, I like the cover. It's creepy, but I think you put that in your window would scare you at night, right? Boo. 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 Whoa. Boo. So, um, that's what we were going to open with you guys for today, but we have a winner to announce, and what is the winner winning, Princess? Thank you, Princess. We got a Batman 3 Joker's War, number one. That is the regular cover, so if you guys didn't have that one, one of you guys will be winning it now. And we're going to be using the comment picker from last Wednesday. Zach, if you want to All right. pull that so, up. So, this might be a little interesting. So, let's see if I can get you. Okay. I got the URL in it already. So, 37 unique comments. Oh, let's see. Oh, yeah. This mouse is a little weird. Okay, there you go. So, I'll start. Picking, picking, picking. <laughs> so, every comment that has a really good. Oregon! Oh, Oregon one. Oregon Weem, right? Yeah. What did he say, Zach? In his oh. Uh, challenge accepted, Zach. Challenge accepted. Just remember, you brought this on yourself. <laughs> Hi, Coco. I was like, what? What did I challenge you? What did I do? Sorry. <laughs> All right. Congratulations, All right. Oregon. You're a, a definitely a long time watcher and good friend of the show. Actually, really good friend of the princesses. So, um, be happy to send you out your Three Jokers War book. Congratulations. I hope you enjoy the read as much as we did. Challenge accepted. Was the challenge to drink a whole beer? Yeah. In I'll one work. minute? I've had years of experience. Yeah, right. All right, guys. So that's our show for the day. If you like our show, love our show, hit the subscribe button. Hit the like button. Leave a comment down below because we love to read your guys' comments. Don't forget about the notification bell. And as usual, guys, every we're going to try this out. But every Monday, we're going we're gonna to be sharing the gains of the community, flexing with you guys. So if you want to... Send us pictures of your games on IG and any messages or notes you want us to read, and we'll present them. We'll, we'll show them on our show on Monday where we flex with you guys. Yeah, it's so. pretty, pretty amazing, pretty awesome that you guys are getting those gains, and you're flexing, and you're being part of this great community. Ooh. We really, really, I mean, I'm, I get so... I get so excited. Yeah, we were pumped to see those yeah. books we got last week. And I was like, man, That's those are so cool. So send us anything you guys want, man. We would love to, to show your stuff on our show. Yep. Yeah, we definitely do. So uh, anything else, Zach? Oh, you want to share how you do that. You have to go to a place called Camp Crystal Lake. Oh. And, you know, be uh, yourself. Be a little different. And, you know, some count counselors don't pay attention. Something happens. Couple years later, your mom, not too happy with them, gets her revenge. But then you never, you never actually go anywhere. You are still there, and then you wear a pillowcase, and for some you, reason you enact your mother's revenge because for some reason, and then eventually you get a hockey mask and a machete, and that's how you get those games. But peace is better than violence. Just also. That's but how you get those Halloween games. That's how you get those Halloween games. You become games. Jason Voorhees. Jason Voorhees. Peacefully. Peace, peacefully, Jason Voorhees? Peacefully. You can just, like, help old ladies across the street and cats and trees and stuff and wear a hockey mask. Right. They, they like, they're running for some reason, and you, like, somehow come up behind a tree, like, 
let me help you get to the other side of the road. There you go. There you go. And that's that's how you get those games. All right, guys. Everybody stay safe out there. We will see you soon. We will see you soon. Get those games. Get them.